<laughs> which was different in a street fight. <laughs> yeah, you don't see much of those. Wow. Yeah. So those fights that we just talked about technically don't count on Gray's record. So he makes his UFC debut at the Tough Fight finale against an eight and six Rob Emerson. And technically speaking, you're two and oh. And yeah. Gray, it's it's one of the most bizarre endings to a fight yeah. possibly in UFC history. Would you mind walking us through it? Yeah, Rob Emerson, he was actually uh, he was like we were pretty close on the TV show and uh, he was, was that intentional. He was, what? It was it intentional that they put you guys yeah, together? Yeah, they yeah, they probably did that, you know. But um um he he was a really talented, he was an athlete. Uh he went up a lot he went up against a lot of uh you know good guys. Um, uh, you know, he had some losses, but um his record didn't really show yeah. like how good he was. And uh, you know, I took that seriously and and uh trained hard for it and I remember the last week Joe Stevenson he came in to help me out you know to do the weight cutting and to do the last little um, kind of preparation and he had me picking up this heavy bag and slamming it like over and over okay okay boom boom and I remember in the fight having him up against a cage and picking him up because usually mm -hmm. in wrestling, like we don't slam people, we take them down. <laughs> um, you know, it might be kind of hard, but I picked him up and I was like, Oh, this is just, this is exactly what we drilled. And I slammed him, not taking into account that it's not a heavy <laughs> bag around girthy, heavy <laughs> bag. It's a human being. And, uh, you know, I just slammed him as hard as I could. And, uh, yeah, yeah, that canvas, that canvas hurts. <laughs> <laughs> so I hit my forehead, and uh, yeah, I was I was definitely not out, but I was I was rocked. I was like, oh yeah. my god, this is what think, it feels like to be rocked. I think you know, I think the I birds were flying around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember <laughs> trying to get up, and my body just wasn't doing anything. I was just like, oh my god. Wow. so but so, that's half my paycheck right you know so uh yeah it gets, I was kind of just to kind of frame it properly yeah grace slams great grace slams rob emerson and emerson bellows in pain when he hits the mat and he's like ah! and the referee stops it except gray hit his head so hard that he kind of flops over and it's ruled a no contest because they're saying Gray knocked himself out, you know, while Rob Emerson, you know, audibly tapped. Yeah. And, yeah. you know, afterwards, Joe Rogan's interviewing Gray and it's, it's not a good, it's not a good thing when somebody has been concussed to interview him and <laughs> <laughs> Rogan, you know, has done that on several occasions. And, and you know, he knows that he, he admits he shouldn't. He doesn't but, like to do it. Yeah. 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 Sometimes he gets caught up in it. And, and this is one of the examples, like Tiki Goshen's another one. He probably shouldn't have interviewed you based on the fact that, I mean, you, 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 you got cracked. You got cracked hard on yeah. that canvas. Here's the thing. I knew exactly what I was saying. I was lying through my teeth, you know, because. You had to. Yeah, your money. I had to. I'm, I'm, uh, that's half my money. And, uh you know, I'm just like, you know, and it's, it's not a win, which I want. It's not a win. You know, yeah, you're looking and at I, it like an attorney. Like if you're an yeah. attorney, your client may have killed 50 people. Check out the full interview on iTunes, Spotify, and all major podcast platforms.